A financial boon for the city is something both Democrats and Republicans can get behind. This is about a business position and the benefits for the future of Milwaukee to attract other large-scale events. Mayor Cavalier Johnson has backed the convention from the beginning. I want them to spend all of their money and put the eyes of the world uh, on Milwaukee. And then, as a Democrat, I'm going to campaign for President Joe Biden, who's running for re-election. Visit Milwaukee expects an economic impact of $200 million. They estimate 45,000 attendees and 15,000 media will show. It really seems like recovery is on its well, well on its way and that my team has had a part in making that happen. Generating all those jobs and money costs money, and there's fundraising left to do. Host Committee Secretary Gerard Randall believes they'd spend between 72 and 75 million on the convention. So far, they've raised about a third of that. Milwaukee's not known as a convention city. Do you think 2024 may be a start of something new? When I look at this convention, I honestly see this as the remaking, the reimagining of the hospitality industry for this community. The city is confident it can host, leaning on advanced planning for a 2020 Democratic convention that became largely virtual. The Wisconsin Center is also being expanded by 50 percent, and Pfizer Forum, another likely venue, could help accommodate massive crowds. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.